How do you see the fight in Tamil Nadu? It's a three-way fight or just a two-way fight between DMK and ADMK? It's always a two-way fight between DMK and ADMK. ADMK and DMDK were alliance with BJP once. There's no doubt. But this time, we have cleanly we decided Mr. Adapadi Palani Sami and Dendra Sagar Premalata Vijayakant have cleanly decided that no BJP is here and there's no hunky-punky games here. Our goal is 2026, 2024 is the start. Late actor and politician Vijayakant's son Vijay Prabhakaran is contesting election from Virudhunagar. Sir, what are your expectations from the people today? What are the key issues which people are going to vote in Tamil Nadu and especially your constituency? Uh, people are really happy uh, that I have been the candidate of Virudhunagar and uh, after my father's demise, uh, people like really uh, fond of our party and since I am stepping up, people have wanted to come forward and take over the party and for the people. And around Virudhunagar constituency, you see uh, one one Virudhunagar uh, Lok Sabha constituency is six uh, MLA constituency. So each constituency differs from, varies from each places. If you take uh, Sivagasi and Virudhunagar and uh, Satur, mm -hmm. more, may, uh, mainly it's a problem of uh, firecrackers issues are here. Yes. And if you go to Tirparankundram Thirpa, and Tirmang towards it's based on Ames um, uh, Hospital and uh, IT parks over there. So these are the major problems here. And if you go down to the rural areas, each villages they have different problems like road facilities or water facilities or light or they need some yes. uh, marriage halls kind of stuff. So these are the common pro problems around Virudhunagar. So you look forward to take your father's legacy ahead? Yes, when I joined, uh, when I was announced as candidate, I told the people that uh, I'm here for my father's dream and I want to fulfill his dream, that's why I'm here. Though I'm just 32 years old, yes. uh, last six years uh, when my father was ill, when, he's down, when he was sick, I, stepped, I came forward and for his wish and for his uh, followers who believe, believed in us, for them I'm here. So all my uh, wishes have kept us here and for here. So definitely uh, after this election, after the election, I'll know like how quick and how forward I can take his legacy. Sir, how do you see the fight in Tamil Nadu? It's a three-way fight or just a two-way fight between DMK and ADMK? It's always a two-way fight between DMK and ADMK. Maybe just in the medias and the top people, maybe BJP might be big. But when you go down the roots, still BJP don't have that uh, structure as compared to DMK, ADMK and our DMDK party. BJP on all on top, you, when you see, they might be uh, big when uh, debates in social medias or medias like that, they might sound big. When you go down to rulers, if you come south here and all, BJP are not that strong. So you don't think that PM Modi's rally and Amit Shah coming to uh, Tamil Nadu will make any change? No, nothing, nothing. Not even a one person impact is going to happen. Not even a young candidate like Annamalai? No, nothing. I, I See, I'm not offensive or anything against BJP, but I'm t talking the facts. Maybe, uh, that's what I'm saying, the metropolitan cities, People or youngsters, as you say, they might support Anamale or Modi G for a, for a certain amount of person. When you go down the roots, since I'm a Virudhanar candidate, I'm talking from down the roots. When you go down towards the south of Tamil Nadu, people don't uh, support as much as the metropolitan cities or towards how big they, they propagate themselves in the north India. That sound doesn't work in Tamil Nadu and towards the south of Tamil Nadu doesn't work at all. So we spoke to Manikam Tagore as well. He's saying that you are the B team of BJP. That is what he's alleging. No, that is his uh, last minute that he, he knows that he's going to lose. So somehow he needs to break the words that are coming to us. So he's just telling the B team. There's nothing a A team or B team. ADMK and DMDK were alliance with BJP once. There's no doubt. But this time, we have cleanly we decided, Mr. Adapadi Palani Sami and Dendra Sagar Premalata Vijayakant have cleanly decided that no BJP is here and there's no hunky-punky games here. We are going. 2011, we formed the alliance. We won. When uh, uh, Madam Jalita was the CM and uh, Vijay Gansh was an opposition leader, and now it's the same. It's going to be re replicate. So our our goal is 2026. 2024 is the start. So final question: What will be the appeal to the voters? Now, final few hours are left. Please don't sit at home. Go and vote. Just 50 percent of polling has been done. All more voters should come and vote and uh, un democratic uh, in the country, everyone has to vote and uh, new change has to happen. Youngsters like us uh, uh, competing for, against big giants. So please support us and bring change to us. Thank you so much for talking to me and all the best. With, with camera person Cypress Patil, this is Saurav Vaktanya in Virudhunagar for India Today.